The Chicago River stands as one of the most extraordinary examples of how engineering can literally rewrite natural geography. Known as the river that flows backward, it no longer follows its original course but instead moves along a path imposed by human intervention. Originally, the river flowed naturally into Lake Michigan, the primary source of drinking water for the city of Chicago. By the late 19th century however, explosive urban and industrial growth had turned the river into a conduit for sewage and waste. Contaminated waters poured into the lake, triggering outbreaks of typhoid and cholera that threatened public health. The solution was one of the most ambitious and revolutionary feats of hydraulic engineering ever attempted, the Chicago Sanitary and Ship Canal, completed in 1900. Through a complex system of canals, locks and diversions, engineers managed to reverse the river's flow, directing it toward the Mississippi Basin rather than into Lake Michigan. This intervention not only eliminated much of the public health crisis, but also established Chicago as a laboratory of modernity, a city capable of bending the laws of nature to meet the demands of urban civilization. Today the Chicago River remains a symbol of the tension between nature and human ingenuity, its reversed course studied as both an engineering masterpiece and a landmark in environmental management. If you enjoyed the video, subscribe to the channel and discover more curious and amazing content. Don't miss out, thank you.